go confess to church, girl. <laughs> Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I have Karina and Peter here. We're gonna be reading your deepest, darkest secrets. I've done this on my own, I'm so excited. They actually asked our people to on Instagram. Girl, let's dig in. Today's video is sponsored by Chispa. As y'all may already have heard, I am teaming up with them. This is an exclusive dating app for Latinos. I am so excited, you guys. I wanna help y'all feel beautiful and confident in your own skin. With the support of Chispa, I'm gonna be giving one of you a chance to win a one-on-one -on -one makeup session with me through video call. I am so excited, you guys. I'm gonna be your makeup consultant, girl. I will be going over my best beauty products and best beauty kept secrets. I will be also showing the winners ways to stay glamorous all the time, girl. We love a girl that's glamorous. So all y'all gotta do is log into your free Cheesepot account and find my picture and make sure you guys register before August 8th. Make sure to click the link down below in the description box to download the free Cheesepot app today. Good luck, you guys. I cannot wait to meet one of you. So now now on back to the video. Ooh. Me and Karina actually just swapped right now clothing. If you guys saw like in the sponsor, I actually have this hoodie on, so if y'all are confused, I did the intro. I'm just kidding. <laughs> so we actually made Rosa's buffalo chicken dip. Ever since I saw this video, I've been wanting to make it. This is it right here. So we're gonna eat while we read your guys' deepest dark seeds. <laughs> Let's, Let's just get, get into straight it, into it, girl. This is the slaps. Girl, dude, this, this is bomb. Oh yeah, my nothing. god, she's greasy the house, but Jesus, she's amazing. Mm. Wow, <laughs> all of us right now. Ooh, mm. a little Girl. mukbang moment. Mm -hmm. Oh my god, this is so good. Two. I'm sorry, I think I need a fork. Oh, mm. Mm. oh my Whoa. god, this is so good, y'all. Girl, I mean, girl, is this a mukbang or we a fashion? We were starving. I've actually never done one of these videos and I have seen yours. So I'm excited because whenever I'm watching Myra's and I'm like, can I just talk about how my hair is a mess? Like I literally girl. just threw my weave on and I was like, I'm done. Can we talk about the fact that this is really good? Like this it's slap. Good. And it was a really, really easy recipe too. You made it so quick. Okay, first assumption. This one is crazy. It says, I used to my uncle when I was younger. Now we act like nothing happened. Like your tío, like I'm like Are these him. real? People are crazy, dude. Really, but well, Thanksgiving okay. must be really awkward. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> I love how we were so into our food. <laughs> no, like wow, I'm, that's so insane. I'm kind of concerned. Like, how old were you? These are some crazy confessions. Because like the feels most likely like a lot older than her, right? And, you know, if she's confessing to it, like LOL, I used to my uncle. I'm assuming like, you know, it was consensual, right? Dude, what the f <laughs> Me and my cousin had and he got me pregnant and I had an abortion no one ever found out. Oh what? my god. Oh my gosh. Who had her cousin? Yeah. <laughs> Holy what is up with all this incest? That's crazy. It's um, the forbidden fruit, sweetie. I, was gonna, yeah. I don't get it. Like, I don't care how freaking cute my cousin is, girl. That I don't care if he's weird. the most attractive thing in the world. I don't know. I don't know, girl, but Christmas and Thanksgiving must be real awkward. Like, don't catch me at the family reunion, honey, because there's gonna be- Like, I don't wanna- you know why I'm having such a hard time reacting? Because I don't wanna, like, judge them for it. If I was genuinely hearing cheese man, somebody was telling me, like, did you hear so-and-so her cousin? And be like, oh, what the f How does that even, like, begin to happen? How does that conversation start? It's just too weird for me. Y'all need to start, like, going out a little bit. You know, there's people out there- <laughs> Explore, honey. Dude, I, I'm seeing a lot of this like cousin stuff. I cheated on my boyfriend with his cousin. I mean, y'all still crazy. I once put a Ken doll up my. I'm sorry, girl. Is anybody else like eating like crazy in this video? I haven't stopped. I've heard some crazy things people put up there, like insane girl. The shower head. Toilet paper. <laughs> I was like, what? The whole roll. I'm just kidding. You just... Girl, here I am. Going for your fifth Living plate. Living my best life. <laughs> my friend is having with her cuñado, esposo de su hermana. Mm. Now to that, I will say it loud and proud. What the f is wrong with you? That's when I, that's the thing that's that I the, never like, understand. I don't get that. That's the kind of sh that I've never understood. Even growing up hearing like from like acquaintances, shouldn't it be off limits? Even your, your friends, man. Girl uh, your code, friends, honey. who the, the f raised you? Oof, I can't with these people. That's insane. All these fish, girl. And you want your sisters. I know you have to share everything growing up, girl, but that's her man. Oh! <laughs> she loved getting hand me down. Dead ass. The husband, though. The audacity bitch. Dog. Animal. Pig! And she's, I think she's talking about somebody she knows. Girl. <laughs> I 
I've been in an abusive relationship for the past eight years and I'm dumb but scared to leave. Oh girl. That's hard. Leave that man. I mean, it's gonna be hard. It's one of those things that like, you That's know really you're gonna hard. leave him eventually, I'm sure. Cause like you're opening up so about sad. it, you know. I'm assuming like you want to do it and you're probably gonna do it in the future. It's just about taking it at your own pace. Just know that one day you're gonna look back and be like, wow. I mean, I haven't been in that situation but I have been in, toxic, in a toxic relationship and it's just kind of like one of those things that you deal with it up until the point that you can't take it anymore so I feel like with that it's crazy because like you just really do it with time but like if I could tell any friend or just anybody I'd be like know your freaking worth first of all like I know it's hard to just you know it's easier said than done and sometimes you know you're just there like the costumbre and the chances are if you if you're expecting for him or her to change they're not going to I would just say if you're watching this just keep your head up and you know keep moving forward and just remind yourself every day that you are that I don't know. It is one of those things that like, even if people tell you like, just leave him, leave him, leave him. It's something that you have to like, you have to make that decision on your own. Yeah. But eventually you will. And that's on period. Ain't nobody got your back like oh, you do, girl. Oh, Ooh, I'm getting full, girl. I'm taking the sodium of it all. I had sex with my boyfriend with the door half open when his mom was cooking in the kitchen. <laughs> Ooh, I mean, did she get Girl, caught? obviously she didn't. Good for her. Ooh, okay. But girl, girl. she's scandalous. She didn't give a that's scary. Have y'all ever done some crazy things in front of family? Um, and you know that you might just get caught? Yeah. Oh, I think everybody. we all have. Ah! I think we've all been there. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> My best friend's cousin made out with me and asked me to have a threesome with him and I never told my best friend. I'm sorry, best friend's uh, boyfriend. Uh-uh. -oh. My best friend's boyfriend. Like your best friend's boyfriend? Mm -hmm. You make out with your best friend's boyfriend and he mm -hmm. tells you on the low, like, let's have a threesome and you never tell your best okay, friend. Okay, this is where you got me f***ed up. Hold on. <laughs> <laughs> Honey, this buffalo chicken got a feeling she's like, wait. See, this is the thing. I feel bad, but I'm trying not to see like the face behind the the confession. I feel bad because you you guys are like. And that's the point, though. We're reacting to it. It's our natural reaction. So I'm really off. just trying. Look, I'm not really, truly, I'm not trying to offend anybody. I'm just trying to see it as like you know a blind face, just kind of just anybody doing it. And as much as it hurts, like that is the natural reaction that you would get out of people. So you're saying that you kissed him, like you made out with. Well, him. she said he kissed her, and he asked for a threesome, mm -hmm. and she never told her best friend. So like, I'm just trying to him. figure out if like if y'all. Best friend's kiss? boyfriend? Yeah, so like, say your best mm -hmm. friend, right? His boyfriend kisses you. So she's kind of making it seem like he kissed her, which. But how did that conversation lead to a threesome? That's what I want to know. Oh! And that's where she's mute. <laughs> <laughs> this is the thing. If he, like, you know, maybe he kissed you and you were like, oh, this happened and like you know kind of like with Jordan oh I don't know how that situation was because I think that's she did actually admit exactly what happened no but with her I think she did admit that it was like yeah she kissed him back right I thought they okay or I don't <laughs> she really did that <laughs> let's say that you actually didn't like kiss him back right like worst case yeah he like he forced his kiss onto you and you were like oh my gosh like did he kiss you and then say let's have a threesome in your face or like they obviously made out or whatever and like he told her on the low like I would love to have a threesome with you. That's what I feel like anybody would think. But like the, the friend, the best friend didn't obviously know about the make out or the threesome. Yeah. So, so like I feel like first of all if my friend's man ever kissed me or anything, anything of the sort, anything at all, like I'm running to her immediately like for the kiss alone. But maybe let alone girl, like threesome girl, what kind of conversations are you guys having to begin with? See I don't get it. The, the only situation it would make sense in is if if he kissed her like unexpectedly and immediately following said I want to have a threesome that I would be like <gasps> flabbergasted first I would still tell my friend first of all obviously this like, is something on the low I don't know girl it's just you know the way I'm interpreting it is like y'all kiss and then y'all were talking dirty and then that came up I dated two brothers and had with both in different years, but I didn't know they were bros. She didn't know. She, she didn't, didn't know. But like, I just could never imagine sharing like a dick with my sister. That is so weird. Awkward. The kickbacks, girl. I started on the treadmill at the gym one time. Me. <laughs> I need to be at the gym first of all. <laughs> girl, I'm full. I'm Full, I'm stuffed. This is so good. Should I read a couple more and close out this video, girl? Because I am full the city. Girl, I'm wearing like this little, this like low shirt and Ooh, my bra is showing okay. a lot. Sorry, guys. This is a good one. I'm still with my baby daddy after he cheated on me twice. And he had two children with two other women. Who, <sighs> girl. Girl, that's... I'm sorry, what happened? <laughs> Sweetie. Honey, you gotta go. He got to no, go. No, he got to go. The toxic...
really something, huh? It's really hard to it's judge. It's changed, man. Married. Is it going to change? It's hard to, it's hard to judge a family, especially that has kids. So I don't have kids. I don't know what that's like. He started a whole family without you. He started two whole families. Honey, he you. started a whole village. And then you take him back? Like, dang. But it's hard to judge because, like, Bobby obviously. Have you cheated on? A thousand percent. How does it feel, girl? Horrible. I know that people say, like, I'm you'll sorry, know I'm when about you're to in that explode, position. But... Honey, you explode the bathroom. But like, like as of now, it. like my emotions, me right now, like I really think I would be like, that's it. Because I don't know, because I feel like a lot of times like when you let it slide, you're kind of letting him know that he could do it again and you're going to let it slide again. Do you guys believe they change? Like cheaters yeah. change? Yeah. I believe that. I, I believe, believe that change, for some people. But there's always going to be like that little like ticking. I think it depends on the age. I feel like if you're like new in a relationship and you cheat, I feel like that's more common. I feel like they could change, but they can definitely do it again. Say Raul will cheat, tell me, right? If God himself comes down to earth and tells me he's never gonna do it again he loves you he fucked up it was a mistake he would hear it forever i would still be like you still did it though so what's good and you did this for what <laughs> <laughs> when you do see a family who makes it work you do kind of like you know mm -hmm. i'm cheering them on i'm like make it work for your family if you guys are in love and happy for the know? kids do it for yourself for yourself and for just everything, the because whole situation. it comes out harsh, but like you're gonna hurt your kids, they're gonna see everything if you're doing it more for them. And like you know in your heart, you know deep down, like if you're happy in that relationship or not. So it's literally all up to like what you wanna do at the end of the day, but period. We're gonna do one more little secret, y'all. These are crazy. I dated a baby daddy and we was using the baby mama's truck. <laughs> <laughs> Typical. Imagine that. <laughs> well, damn. Like, he don't got his own truck? Girl. They were using the mama's truck. Oof. So who's supporting who? So who Is the baby mama support? supporting y'all? I feel like that would be, yeah. That would be the biggest slap in the face. Ho like, hopefully they use it. Y'all are in my car that I pay for. I would drag that bitch out of the car. No, you know what's, like, worse? When you hear, like, people say, like, <laughs> like oh, they in our bed. How y'all freeloading on his baby mama? Let's we're actually, one. yeah, let's do another one now that we're here. I slashed my ex's tires because he left me for another girl. Offer for him to come back. Oh! <laughs> so he came back with a slash tire. <laughs> <laughs> he came back with four new tires. When you're mad, you must do the craziest yeah. shit. Yeah. Would you be discreet and do it behind his back, or would you make him see you pop his tires? Pop, pop. No, I, I would be like Carrie Underwood. Have like, you ever seen those crazy videos where people oh. walk in on them like actually? Like, what would you do? Or would you pretend you didn't see it and just like... I, I feel like I'd be like, ooh, or... Like, I don't know if I would actually make it known that I'm there. I'm gonna let you know I'm here. The wrath has arrived. Come get with my buffalo dip for you. Find <laughs> you with another bitch. <laughs> Stop breaking the pad on your head. I mean, you f***ed the owl If she's on top of him, like, she's the first one I'm going for. But then, like, I'm also gonna whoop your ass. Don't you think I'm forgetting about you? I'm whooping both your asses, mother. <laughs> and you'll be lucky to leave alive. I can't even imagine like the situation. I feel like just naturally like I would just go well, for both of them. I would go for her and I would go for him. And well, she's on top of boyfriend. So her many first, stories. Like, and that is when it's okay to fuck his brother. Imagine <laughs> that's when you go for the cousin. Mm. That's the only ah. time it's exceptional. You know? And ask him how you <laughs> Taste. Yeah, they're all these crazy stuff like, yeah, I did it with his brother or uh -huh, his cousin, and uh -huh. you're like, ooh, girl, why would you do that? If you told me the backstory was this, I'd be like, <laughs> <laughs> somebody said, I like getting my ass licked every day. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> Peter's like, same. We heard that, ladies. I lost my virginity at school, and I got caught by the teacher. Oh, like the teacher washed oh, in on them. Shoot. Oh my god, Ooh, that's girl. A, that's a girl, they were Wait, doing so it. Wait, so the parents found so out. They, they were probably doing it during detention and then. Oh my god, the teacher. Mr. Had... Jefferson walks in like, oh, 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 get it, girl. <laughs> <laughs> On a desk, like. I have a feeling like whenever I hear anything about a school, you know, it's usually like in the bathroom or like in some random corner, like where they like try to hide behind a bush or some shit. Uh -huh. Getting that call, like in front of Hello. you, like, they're calling your mom, like, hi, I just caught your daughter. Wait, your mama the... thinks you're Wait, I would have been mortified. mortified. I would not have came home. You know the next day that's gonna spread around like wildfire. I don't know. There was places at my school to like do it at. <laughs> Where was your spot? Okay. Like, what do you say is the spot? The stairs by the ASB room. Okay, I room. see that. I want to have a threesome with my best friend and her boyfriend because I have a crush on him, but she doesn't know. That's that sounds like problems already. You just want him, not her. Like, I feel like she's asking for the threesome because that's the only way she's gonna get to him. And that's already asking for problems. That is so weird. And then again, though, there's a lot of people that make it work. Yeah. Who knows? But she's doing it for all the wrong reasons. She wants to do it for getting yeah, the Yeah, because guy this is a, like a girl coming into a relationship asking for a threesome. I feel like a healthy this relationship, did, they're the ones, mm -hmm. if they want a threesome, they're gonna go ask a friend or a stranger. But a random 
trying to get into your guys' relationship, that's already like a mess. And especially that they're not for she it. She doesn't have feelings for both of them. She's not sexually attracted to both. She's sexually attracted to one. Some girls just don't know how to act. I guess like it's hard for me to wrap my head around it, like for real. But single, mm -hmm. maybe, yeah. Go off. I mean, if you want to go ahead and do that, go off. I feel like I'm just like really like territorial. Girl! Let's Looking than you, Whoa. looking like Thicky Minaj. Uh, like. I mean, she could be ugly. I would not be okay with a period. I should be enough and more. I think my mom's boyfriend is cute. What the heck? Oh my god. You think your mom's boyfriend is cute? Even if you know somebody's attractive, like a good-looking man, you know, you you acknowledge and you're like, that's a, that's a, that's a handsome man. But when you say, yeah, I think when you're confessing, I think my mama's man is cute. Girl, because you could say your mom's you could probably say mama better watch out <laughs> Mama yeah. better, better run. You could probably say like my mom has a, a Handsome man that she deserves right then being like my man my, my mom's man is cute <laughs> Pour yourself a tall glass of water and drink it cuz you thirsty. She's I drier can't. than the Sahara Desert Does she just think he's cute and it's like an innocent no, 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 she she's thinks confessing she's it. cute. She's confessing it. Like she thinks, she thinks he's cute. She's thinking like hard eyes Start seeing that man as your father's mom's man. I don't care if my mom was dating a 20 year old. He's That's my stepdaddy, period. <laughs> but the it's tea, weird. The real tea is she has that. hard eyes for her mom's dad. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Girl, cut it right now. Cut Just it off by the umbilical cord already. Like, Start seeing that man as family. First of all, you don't want to end in bad terms like with your mother like that. If she catches y'all, like, I don't know how you would even sleep sleep at night knowing that you're doing something with your mom's dad. Well, we don't even know. I mean, <laughs> Well, we get in with the grandma. Oh, she's doing it with the grandma. <laughs> <laughs> oh, she like retirement for <laughs> Mom's boyfriend. Oh, she has hard eyes for her mom's boyfriend. Girl, you need Jesus, period. <laughs> like, like a lot of y'all need Jesus. She said boomer hard eyes. <laughs> <laughs> what? Some of y'all need to go confess to church, girl. <laughs> 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 but you know, this is a thought too. Oh, Bob. Just remember, you always got baggage. Like. <laughs> I'm taking it with you. Please. Yes. Is it worth those five minutes or is it worth the baggage that you gotta drag on? Well, we really hope y'all enjoyed it. If you liked it, don't forget to give it a huge thumbs up. Let us know your juiciest or do you know any juicy stories? Let us know in the comments down below. I hope y'all enjoyed reading these assumptions with me. Okay, now we have to tell our confessions. I'm just kidding. You're yeah. like, oh. <laughs> Thank you for watching and I'll see y'all in the next one. Bye. Bye.